The airport business has changed significantly for Nats in the last 10 years. We've grown to a business that now operates in over 30 countries. We are regarded as one of the leaders in the air traffic management field. Every day we deal with thousands of people's lives. We need to make sure we make safe and good decisions. People want to fly, and people want to fly in a sustainable way. The journey that Nance has been on is unique. We've seen significant growth in the UK over the years, but without any new runways. Gatwick in 1982, we moved 400 flights a day for the first time, and everybody thought that was it. Gatwick now is around about 850 flights a day, still with one runway. Innovation is about the application of creativity. And we've got a philosophy here about innovate and animate, which is have a great idea, but bring it to life really fast so that you can understand how it can create value for your customer. Nats Engineering give a range of services, everything from frontline maintenance through design of systems to full turnkey project delivery. We can integrate people, process and technology to really deliver a business benefit rather than just a technological solution. We learn the basic skills for our job that every day is different. The pilots need to trust that what you're saying is correct. As a visual controller, we control by looking out the window, whether that be taking the aircraft from the parking gates to the runway or watching the aircraft take off and land. Once they're airborne, the wheels are up, they look like they're in stable flight, we transfer it to our radar controllers down at Swanwick. Air traffic management and the environment are inextricably linked. The way we control aircraft has a fundamental impact on the fuel burn, on the noise and on the emissions of the aircraft that we control. For most airlines, 40% of their cost is fuel. If we can reduce that fuel as we're targeting by 10%, then that means economic sustainability and it means environmental sustainability for the airlines. We can create models of airports to test solutions. We can test flight profiles to see how efficiently a change of an airspace design will actually operate in the real world. We work very openly with industry. We invite suppliers in to showcase their capabilities and we try and work with them to develop you know, joint solutions for our customers. We work as a big team, from the controllers in the tower, to the pilots, to the ground staff to all ensure that Gatwick works to its maximum capacity and safely. I think aviation is an amazing industry. It connects people and I want to see aviation grow, but fundamentally aviation needs to grow in a sustainable way if it's going to grow at all. We cannot grow the airspace, so building the technology to allow automation is really key to the future of our business.